and all accused in one of the worst cases of massacre during the 2002 Gujarat riots in the Naroda Gam have been acquitted. This includes former BJP minister and MLA Maya Kudnani and Bajrang Dal's Babu Bajrangi. Eleven Muslims were burnt to death after mobs set their houses on fire in a locality known as Muslim Mohalla Kumbarvas in the Naroda Gam area of Ahmedabad. नमदार कोर्ट ने आज सभी अभियुक्त को बरी करने का आदेश जारी कर दिया है ओपन कोर्ट में क्या रीजन दिया है नो रीजनिंग गिवन जस्ट नाउ स्टिल वी हैव नॉट ऑप्टेन एनी कॉपी ऑफ द जजमेंट कितने थे सर आरोपी कुल मिला के 83 एक्यूज पे चार्ज फ्रेम हुआ था उनमें से 67 मौजूद थे एक एक्यूज आज एब्सेंट था जिसकी प्रेशर बढ़ गया था इसी बात थी Maha, as far as the grounds for acquittal are concerned, once we have and once in, even the lawyers have the order copy, the grounds for acquittal will be clear. But as far as the sting operation by Ashish Khaitan was done, uh, is concerned, which was one of the prime evidences which was submitted in the court, where one of the accused, Babu Bajrangi, who was the Bajrang, the leader, he confessed to have burned down the houses of 11 Muslims. That was not admissible in the court since it was a sting operation carried out by a, by a media personnel. So the defense lawyer has also told us that that was one of the main grounds that there was no direct evidence. As far as uh, the, lawyer, the lawyer who represented the victims are concerned, he told us that they will be challenging the verdict in the high court because for them it is absolute injustice and not just injustice against the victims but it is also uh, against the Supreme Court and the SIT which charged those 86 people saying that they properly investigated their cell phone towers, their FSL reports, there were eyewitnesses against these accused. But still, after 21 years of the victims waiting for justice, now today the special session court in Ahmedabad have acquitted all of them. I'll tell you that the 17, 17, uh, total 18, 86 people were charged out of which 18 uh, died during the trial and they were abated and so today Total 68 accused were acquitted. Now the latest is that the, the victim's family who are absolutely discouraged and they are not welcoming the verdict. They are going to challenge the verdict in the High Court once they have the order copy. But as far as the grounds for acquittal are concerned, we spoke to Shamshad, uh, Shamshad who, is the, who is the lawyer of the victim. He said that from forensic report to the cell tower location, to the eyewitnesses, to doctors, uh, who gave their center, uh, who gave their statements against these 86 accused absolutely everything was against these accused but still the court decided to acquit them so they are going to challenge the verdict in the high court they are also going to write to the SIT who charged these accused uh, to understand that what could have been the grounds but uh, the politician, as far as the politics is concerned, the Congress, which is non-existent in the state of Gujarat, is saying that we are going to side with the victim's family. And as far as BGP is concerned, we have no reaction as of yet. But one of the spokesperson I was speaking to, he said, the let's law take its own course and we are not going to comment. Back to you.